Okay, don't bite. This is a note. You like notes, remember? Well, here goes nothing. Go, baby, for la revolucion! for me? I know what you're up to. I've been watching. I'm coming to sprout you myself. George truly, Hector Lemans. I knew it! I knew he was out to get me the whole time! But you'll never find my secret out at all. You're going to have to find yourself another florist! Gotta figure out some way to disguise this pretty face before I hit the streets. It's not like Johnny Thunder lets just anybody in his review. No. I mean, being allowed to wear the Johnny Thunder makeup is an honor. Yes. A privilege. Yes. So I said to her, you said that? Well, and then, here's the good part. No kidding. Mmm, show business coffee. I am a busy man. Oh, coffee, great. About time we got a PA around here. Hey, kid, keep it black and keep it coming, all right? Uh -huh. Of course, as soon as I save up enough money for a double-end ticket, I'm out of here. What? You can't just buy a double-end. Well, I know somebody who knows somebody who knows uh, Hector Lamas. Wow, you know everybody. Wow. Oh, coffee. Thanks. And the director says... I don't see any place to serve coffee here. A real amateur? You don't say. But, but I guess so. I am not. Ah! Oh! oh, what did you do that for? I didn't. I. You melted my makeup. I can't go on like this. I took you under my wing, and this is how you pay me back. No, no, it's not like that. A little too hot. A little too hot for my pockets, thank you. I don't see any place to serve coffee here.
Hey, kid, this is your lucky day. We got an opening, and you're the newest Thunder Boy in the Johnny Thunder Review. Yes, I've been working for this moment all my life. Then sit on down. We got to start your makeup. Now, don't go too far. You never know what time is showtime around here. Snowmaker is huge, but the grinder part looks handheld. Aha! It's a handheld grinder. Up. This elevator goes up straight to the penthouse suite of Hector Lamans. Mr. Lamans, he only do the business with the very select elite clientele. Hi, Calivio. I can't remember the last time I had access to a men's room. Soldiers getting by without this arm. Grinder. I think he'd be happy to know his body was serving the cause like this. Hmm. The 
flakes of bone are sprouting when they hit the puddle and turning into baby tears. I think I could follow the trail this way, but I need a little light. Hey, what's that? That must be the floor's hideout. No, not that. The thing coming at us! That you? Can't read. You better back off, man. I mean it. I'm not feeling too rosy. I'm having. I feel. I'm thinking I better. Hey, do you know what you just did? You just opened Pandora's box. You get out of here right now, or I'll let you have it. I'll... Hey there, stranger. Can I help you? Uh, uh, I'm looking for something in a 9 millimeter. Oh, well, I have a very pretty bouquet of that right here. There you go. Would you like some baby's bread to go with that? Sure. All right, here you go. You have a great day now. Hey 
Hey, what's going on under that raincoat? I don't know what's going on under that makeup. Agent Calavera? You? Didn't Salvador chop you in half early this evening? Yes, which has given me this glorious opportunity to serve the cause by gathering funds for the LSA while stealing from our arch enemy at the same time. Hola. No drinks for me, thanks. Buenos dias. Back off, sleazeball, or my husband here will bust your jaw. Hola. No drinks for me, thanks. Mechi, it's me. Manny? That's some costume. Here, help me get Mr. High Roller here into this sheet so we can get out of here. Hey, is that you, young lady? I'll get you. I'm going to help oh. this twerp the first chance I... What exactly are you doing with these slot machines? I stick hey. myself inside like a finger down the throat of Hector Limons himself. And I make the machine regurgitate the wealth it has devoured. Yeah, not funny. Oh. Special assignment Lady. just in from Salvador. Crack that machine Not and leave funny. the change right away. Yes, sir! God. Hey! Help! Oh. Young lady. Oh, for crying out loud. Back! did it! My system worked! I knew it! I told you! That's great! Now let's go so you can buy me a drink at the Romano. I'll meet you at the train station with the tickets. There won't be one from me, so you'll have to go back by yourself. I'll tell that gatekeeper everything. He has to help us. Come, my lovely. I have another infallible system I'd like to demonstrate. Ow. in the shoulders, but at least it doesn't reek of sled dog. I'm here to conduct business with Hector Lamans. I just spoke with him on the phone and he's expecting me. You know Hector Lamans, eh? Crocky dokey. Then answer me this one simple question. Huh. Okay, how old was Hector Lamans when he stole his first dollar? I guess you don't know heck. Huh. Okay, how many times has Hector Lamans unsuccessfully run for mayor? Twelve. Oh, I. Okay, if Hector Lamont were driving a car 50 miles an hour, then... Twenty-five? Yeah, well, that was an easy one. Too bad, I win. Best two out of three. Don't mess with me. I know Hector Lamont. Celso Flores, what are you doing in Hector Lemon's waiting room? Oh, he sent us out here to make up our minds about his offer. Who are you? If you don't mind me asking. Is this your wife, Celso? Yes, we've just returned from a lovely cruise. Well, it became lovely once I caught up with you, my little tamale. 
Actually, I work for Hector. He sent me to answer your questions. Uh, I'll handle this, my sweet one. What can you tell me about these double-end tickets? This price seems much more than double. The real question is, don't you feel you're worth it? I know we're worth it, but are the tickets worth it? Well, they cost a mint because they save you a mint. Well, I don't have a mint. What exactly are you saving your money for? A rainy day? Because let me tell you, you're dead. Every day is rainy from now on. Yes, but there's no reason not to be careful with your money. It's a scam. The tickets are counterfeit. Take your money and run. Ho, ho, ho! Don't try any of that tricky reverse psychology on me, my friend. Well, enough about you guys. Let me tell you about my problems. Actually, we have a lot of talking we need to do, so... I just got back from the worst vacation I've ever had. Actually, I just got back from quite an adventure myself, so... Well, I'm sure you've seen flying spiders and flaming beavers, but trust me, it gets worse. You see, I've been to the edge of the world and back. I had no idea traveling the land of the dead was so fraught with peril. Now, how much would you pay just to skip the whole thing? Darling, come. Let us blow our nest egg together. Mr. Lamans, we've decided to take you up on your generous offer. Excellent. Excellent. The little lady changed your mind, eh? No. Actually, it was your agent over there. Well, I'm, 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 of course. He's one of my best. <laughs> well, come on in. Let's chat, shall we? Ah, still got it. I don't know who you are, and I don't know what spell you cast on the florist couple, but stick around. Once I'm done with them, there's something across town I'd like to show you. Am I talking about just a job here, or am I talking about opportunity in the general sense? We've had a lot of openings in this office in the last couple of years, and frankly, we've had trouble filling them. I could really use a closer like you on the team. This could be your office. Yeah, try this on. See how it feels. That's yours too. And as an added bonus, 2% of these, Mr... My name's Calavera, and I want a bigger cut. <laughs> oh, but Mr. Calavera, I'm going to need most of these to get myself out of this world. You see, I've been a very bad boy. <laughs> I'm going to deliver those tickets to their rightful owners, and I'm going to deliver you to the Campos pile. I... Friends now? I bet I could get over to the other roof on the leg of this sign, but the legs pointed too far down and it looks like Hector blew the motor. It's cracked, but still stronger than me. It's cracked. Deuce, deuce, deuce. It's cracked, but still stronger than me.
So much for my third arm. Too steep to climb. Too, too, too steep to climb. Well, so much for my third arm. Eventually. back there. Where are all of Salvador's men? I don't know. He hasn't told me yet. Hola, Manuel. Time for you to swing, daddy -o. Let's see you walk. These flowers? All people Hector has sprouted? Hey, when you're on top like my boyfriend Hector is, you make a lot of enemies. Loves me not. Well, you're half right. Oh, Manny, so cynical. What happened to you, Manny, that caused you to lose your sense of hope, your love of life? I died. I see. <laughs> I guess Domino is right. You don't have a shred of optimism. Well, when it comes to shreds, Dom is the expert. And by that same logic, Manny, you're about to become an expert in botany. Is this where you tell me all about your secret plan, Hector? How you stole double-end tickets from innocent souls, pretended to sell them, but really hoarded them all for yourself in a desperate attempt to get out of the land of the dead? No. <laughs> this is where you writhe around in excruciating pain for about an hour because that idiot Bowsley ran off with all their fast acting sproutella. The slow stuff will sprout you, but it's going to take a long time, I'm sorry to say. <laughs> Manny, where are you going? You've got some time, you know, before you have to leave. <laughs> Get it? Leave. <laughs> Gracias, Toto Santos. <sighs> Salvador? 
Manuel, listen carefully. There's a gun in the trunk of this car, but the trunk key is with my body somewhere in the meadow behind the greenhouse. Find it! Right. And tell Eva that I know she will guide the Alliance wisely when I am gone. For when I bite this explosive tooth, the deadly cloud will sprout not just my target, but me as well. Your target? What are you... Hey, get out of there. Farewell, my friend. What were you talking about with the head of the LSA in there? Huh, Sal? Got something you want to share with the class? Only this. Viva la revolucion! Scythe. Well, what do you know? Sal had a ticket all along. It's amazing how Salvador's ticket is still drawn to him. really want to do that. It's not doing anything. It's not doing anything now. I don't really want to do that. It's not doing it. It's not doing anything now. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I'm not doing anything now. I'm not doing anything now. I'm not doing anything now. Seems to be attracted to something over this one. Seems to seem sick, 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 sick. This must be the key to Salvador's trunk. of ammo. Freeze, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. Freeze, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. I'm not getting any closer until he runs out of ammo. If he runs out of ammo, that is. Freeze, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. I'm not getting any closer until he runs out of ammo. If he runs out of ammo, that is. Freeze, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. Freeze, Hector. 
Yeah, you heard me. You can count them if you want. They're all here. How about yours? The company gave me one on the other end. Sort of a retirement present. And, uh, demons ride free, right? Aw, oh, man, you know I can't go with you. I'm a spirit of the land and all that. I can't ever leave this world. I guess I got so wrapped up in saving people, I just assumed I'd be able to save you too. Yeah, but I don't need to be saved. I like it here. I'm not all alone in that basement anymore, thanks to you. I got a new job and all these new friends. I'm a big demon success story. So, I guess this is it then. Come here, give me a hug. Oof. <laughs> you were the best boss I ever had. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Manny? Yeah? When we get to the next world... What is it, Angel? Are we going to be together? You know, sweetheart, if there's one thing I've learned, it's this. Nobody knows what's gonna happen at the end of the line. So you might as well enjoy the trip.